Hey guys, Dave here. Take a look at this Memorex. This is a mini travel drive, 8 gigabyte, 2.0 flash drive. Uh, nothing overly special about this drive, uh, but let's take a look at uh, its speeds on a Windows 8 computer. Uh, when we get into the package here, specifications is Windows 7, Vista, XP, even 2000. So pretty much every operating system. Uh, it's USB 2.0 required for high speed transfer. It's still going to work on 1.1 and even 3.0 um, USB speeds. So, but it uh, is optimized for the uh, 2.0. All right. It's pretty small. Uh, you can tell here it's just my first knuckle. Smaller than I guess some, um, at all. Got a nice little plastic cap. It does not pop on the back. So that's kind of inconvenient for being able to make sure you don't lose it. Might as well not come with it, really. Uh, Memorex, looks good. Even seems a little loose. and not break easy. So, not necessarily very quality either. Well, uh, let's see what happens here. I'm going to go ahead and plug it into the side over here. Oh, I don't even got one over there. Let's try the other side. There we go. See how long it takes for this computer. Hold it up pretty quick. Didn't take very long at all. Next thing we're going to do is I have a file here. I think it's like 1.1 gigs, 1.06. We're gonna see how long it takes to transfer this. All right, it's moving at about 20 megs, and there it drops down. Now we're moving at about four megabytes. I keep shooting down to two, maybe even three. Uh, I do notice this with USBs as it starts off really fast. I'm not sure why on this computer or this operating system, um, but it seems to start off around 20 and then shoots down to about 4. However, I'm noticing that it is bouncing quite a bit. Let me see if I can get a zoom in here. See a lot of bounce there. Um, normally, I get a very consistent 4 megs. Of transfer speed on my other 2.0 USB flash drives uh, however this one seems to be jumping quite a bit and it's not moving very fast just the the long transfer rate let's see what if we try grabbing a smaller file here Grab this 14,000 or 14 megabyte. Already transferred. Alright, so transfer is awfully quick just for these small files. Which probably isn't going to help me much. <laughs> Try that again. Try this with a 83 megabyte file. Held up to 20 megs per second. Let's see how long it takes it to copy it off. Right, replace the file. Extremely quick. So the read and write seem to be a lot different. So you're going to have a, uh, a write speed. Uh, it's going to be a lot um, slower being able to have to write to the USB flash drive then it's going to be to transfer it off of the flash drive so um, the quality is not that great uh, with more quality parts you're going to find a more consistent speed and uh, but this is what you're going to get when you buy a cheaper one so again the structure is not going to hold up too well I wouldn't advise buying this uh, this cheaper version if, unless you're just needing it for temporary, which is basically what I'm using it for. Uh, a couple files transferred and 
not use it often. If you are looking to use something uh, far more often, I would advise you to get something uh, like a Kingston um, or something in that range. So those those off-brand ones just aren't really going to give you the kind of speed that you're looking for. Thanks for watching, guys.